First migrants from the caravan moving through Mexico are falling asleep in Tijuana tonight. A group of 85 people split from the main caravan, saying they were discriminated against for being LGBTQ. 10 News reporter Cassie Carlisle tells us they are very close to crossing the San Ysidro port of entry. Yeah, these migrants are just a few miles south of the border in Playa de Tijuana, and they had mixed reaction as they arrived at the bus station in Tijuana earlier today. This group of mostly LGBTQ migrants were hopeful and exhausted as they arrived on the last leg of their journey. She says in the caravan they faced discrimination and that's why they separated. She said it's normal because they faced the same discrimination back in Honduras. They took buses to an Airbnb, both paid for by U.S. lawyers. As they arrived, neighbors lashed out. <laughs> Journalist Jorge Nieto saw it happen. Yelling them, like, go away, go to a shelter, this is not your place, all you can hear, uh, this is our, uh, like a safety area, we're afraid of you. He said the migrants defended themselves, saying the neighbors could also hurt them. We're not going to make noise. We're not going to make any mess. Relaying shelters aren't an option. The shelters at the moment are over, to over capacity. They are full of the people uh, who came before. Todos tenemos derecho saying they have the right to seek refuge in another country and pursue a better life with respect. <laughs> They're planning on crossing the border in the next couple days. The rest of the caravan left Mexico City early this morning. Reporting at the San Ysidro Port of Entry, Cassie Carlisle, 10 News.